I'm Carrie Saldo. We're here at the Denver Film Festival speaking with Shannon Kelly, who's connected to the film, the, the video, Monk. How did you get connected to these German electronic music makers? I've been familiar with Monk's uh, work um, for many years. I'm a DJ myself as well as an artist and filmmaker, and we were friends on Facebook. And he, the great connector. Yes, the great social connector. And he put out a call for music video directors. And I thought that's something I've wanted to do for a long time. I have a background in experimental film mostly and, and uh, photography. So I thought that'd be a wonderful project to take on. And so I answered the call and the rest is history. Did you know the, that was going to be specifically for Kitchen Call? Or did they just say, we're looking for someone to do one of our videos? Um, they gave me a couple options. There was a compilation release, uh, and they were trying to feature, they're hoping to feature a couple different songs, um, and they gave me a choice, and that's the one that just left out. And I was a big fan of Monk to, to begin with, and uh, Daniel Avery is another, well, he's an English DJ producer, um, he does incredible work, and he's um, basically remade the track, and it just, yeah, blew me away. So I thought, and there were, a couple lines in the song that really stood out. I didn't really get into the lyrics too much, but it, uh, this idea of being on the phone trying to call, call somebody, there's a longer story behind that, but it, <laughs> the, the sound and the feel really gripped me. So. Well, in the finished music video, there is a single lyric. So how did you come up with the entire storyline for the larger video with only one lyric to work with? Well, um, Christine Buxbaum is a conceptual photographer. We had dated for two years and we went through a breakup. And then at that time, when I was in contact with Monk, we were getting back together. So it was very autobiographical in that sense. Um, we, I, I had a, an initial idea and just sort of a spark of an idea. And she helped flush out the narrative. I mean, she really set the tone for the narrative and a lot of the details in that. And I was just thinking of ways to shoot the narrative, and then we both collaborated on basically all parts. But um, and she she edited the piece together, and I refined that, and so we just bounced it back and forth and refined it from there. So, it's, but the narrative itself is very autobiographical, and, and it does, it does what we went through in being apart, and and the, the challenges and the struggle to get back together and, and really make that connection again. It must have been sort of um, cathartic to have something to, uh, an artistic expression or a way to use that in film. Yes, definitely. Well, some of the, I think the best work, I think, well, Christine and I both, we believe that uh, if you look at our work, that the, the most autobiographical work is the best, it's the truest, because you know it, you know it the best, you know it the most intimately. So, you know, if there's truth in, in art and you're communicating something in some way, then a lot of it's sort of communicated in symbolic ways, so it's more general for people who watch it, experience it. Not so specific to like, this is me and my story, but you know, people can project themselves into the, the story themselves and you know, pull something else out even. Maybe a different storyline, something else that happened or something. Especially with only one lyric. What do you think it is about film as an artistic expression that you relate to? I would say storytelling, but I th it's such a visual medium. I, I don't know, it, it's, it's, I grew up on cult movies and music videos and that's what really got me into film and video to begin with and I studied film. Really wanted to explore the, the different facets of a, a visual medium that could tell a story e e e in ways that words couldn't communicate, uh, in an unusual way too. So. Congratulations on the video, Thank thanks for chatting. Appreciate it.